Louisiana, Bigfoot, in yeah, Honey Island. I, I just, I mean, I love dense areas like this to, to visually. I love the look well, yeah, of this I mean, tropical I would area. Wanna, it's nice to see the photos and the video, but getting into this area would be a real challenge. There's shows like, for example, Sur I think it was called Survivor Man. I think one episode he was in the Amazon, and the area looks fantastic, but they're crawling with bugs. I mean, that's different than Louisiana. You know, I, I'm, I don't know. Louisiana. Is no, no, you have crawling no, with a lot of. No, this too. was like a carpet of, of ants or whatever. It's just phenomenal. It's like nothing you've seen before in the United States, probably. And how do you even travel in an area like that and not get just bit by oh. everything under the sun? And the guy in Survivor Man had to build his. where, where he slept off ground, but, it, but they're just like. Uh, like, Wouldn't they be coming out of the trees and everywhere? Oh, they're everywhere. And, I, and he had some kind of uh, covering over him. But, man, you cannot escape it. And it is miserable. Because once you get bitten by the bugs, you're, like, you know, all over. You're just itching. Now, I don't know if Bigfoot has some kind of resilience against that. Well, that thick fur probably fends off some bugs. But even with with um, fleas and stuff like that, it's got to worry they about burrow ticks. into the yeah, into yeah. fur and get into their skin. It's an itching, uh, crazy nightmare. But man, I do love the look of this, just the lushness of this, you know, it just, it's, it's something that's only in that area, Louisiana, maybe Florida, Mississippi, and... Yeah, definitely in those areas, just well, really, the well, humidity. And, and, and Louisiana doesn't have a lot of palm tree, but it, it plants, but it does have some, and I think... In particular, I, this Honey Island has. Yeah, I think I see some in the photo, yeah, you do see palm trees yeah, here. Yeah, definitely, yeah, this is yeah, somewhere. yeah. That is, that is a cool, swampy area. I love it. And you've been to Louisiana. and, you've, and I've not been to this particular area, but I have been to Louisiana. It's, it's, it's slowly recovering from Hurricane, Hurricane Katrina. Katrina. And it's, it's like California. It's, it's been known for its violence, you know, just because it was recovering from a massive disaster and there's a lot of lawlessness in the area. And it was kind of a corrupt... This isn't that far from New Orleans. I don't think this is that far from New Orleans. No, it's on the other side of Lake Pontchartrain. How this area survived... Well, obviously, Bigfoot survived. Um, well, how it dealt with at the time when the waters were, were must rising. Have been severe. Now, I wouldn't doubt for a second that Bigfoot can climb up trees. That's another thing. We'll talk about that the next episode. Let's do